Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're diving into the second part of our introduction to Sandland. This action RPG lets you play as the Devil Prince Beelzebub and is inspired by an anime created by the late Akira Toriyama. While the third person combat is straightforward, it remains enjoyable. The real depth, however, lies in the car combat, where you can customise and upgrade your car with the loot you find. If you're looking for the opening and more detailed information about the game, I recommend watching the first video I made. I'll link it in the description. But don't leave just yet. Why? But don't leave just yet. Why? Because my first impression is still coming up. Because you are awesome, of course, and because YouTube appreciates it when you stick around. Also, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Now, let's talk a bit about my first impression. I'm impressed with how the story is being told. The game looks beautiful and the voice acting is strong. It plays very fluidly. It's fairly simple, at least so far. But that's fine. Not every game needs to be super deep and I find the car combat super fun. I'll keep it at that until I've played more. I think I'll be playing the rest offline unless there is more interest. Maybe I'll post a late game video as well. The rest of this video will give you a good feel for how the story is told in Sandland. And at the end, there's some exciting tank combat. That's about it for now. Of course, the video will continue to run for a while for those who want to see more. But I'll leave it here. Let me know what other types of videos you'd like to see. More Sandland, or perhaps a different game. I'm happy to try out almost anything. Regardless, thank you for watching and see you in the next one. Not good. Step on it. Not good. Step on it. We might just make it. Not good, step on it. Damn it, here. We just barely escaped! <laughs> that was nothing! We're barely outside the village, and we've lost all our food and water. So, what should we do? Without provisions, surely our only choice is to turn back. Hmm. You know, there should be a town called Talbo not too far from here. Not that I have any money, but we'll figure something out. Sounds like we don't have a choice. Fine then. Let's... All right. Shall we get back to the car? Here we go. Leave the driving to me. Hey. Welcome. <gasps> Please. I can't steal souls. And even if I could, why would I want to? Oh, that so? Well, sure changed. What are you doing here? Oh, I'm just a humble peddler. I'm running low on inventory, so I'm heading back home. So you don't live here? Of course not. This why is that? Well, this and that happened, and the residents went away. How about being less vague? This whole village was built from the ground up during the old war. To 
create a safe place to send civilian evacuees. But when the war ended, so did the Royal Army supply shipments. That cut down the population lickety-split. And as if that wasn't enough, nearby bandits started raiding the place once the army pulled out of the area. What you see before you is the result. You'd better watch out for bandits yourself. <laughs> like petty thieves are gonna scare off a thief. Well, you never can be too careful. You know what they say. An ounce of prevention's worth a pound of cure. On that note, Check out my wares! They're sure to come in handy on your travels. Thank you for coming! Let's head for that stone arch. Talbo's just beyond it. Yeah, it's about time. What about ramming through with a boost? That might break it. Uh, something would break, all right. A car. taken a turn for the worse, sure. But humans had plenty of problems back then, too. Perhaps so. But we were never half as cruel as you demons. Hey, we might play tricks on people, but we don't kill. You must be joking. The legends say that as long as anyone can remember, demons <laughs> have... Ha! <laughs> Humanity has always loved to blame us for anything and everything under the sun. River dried up. I bet you all said it must be the demon's fault, didn't you? What you say is true. Perhaps we have misunderstood you. Now hold on. Don't get the wrong idea. We totally are bad. Why, just yesterday, I stayed up late and went to bed without brushing my teeth. See? Bad to the bone. That's what being a fiend is all about. How about you, old man? Bet you've committed a minor sin. What's up with that rock? It's got weird scribbles on it. Ah, that's a bandit symbol. They use them to mark off their territory. There's bound to be some of them skulking around this area. Look, I like the sound of that. How about a little preemptive bandit butt kicking? No, do not approach them under any circumstances. Understood? Fine. What you say is true. Perhaps we have misunderstood you. Now hold on. Don't get the wrong idea. We totally are bad. Why, just yesterday, I stayed up late and went to bed without brushing my teeth. See? Bad to the bone. That's what being a fiend is... Uh -huh. Fresh meat? Inbound! Huh? First one in ten days. What? what the heck just... All four tires punctured. Have at them, boys. Go rob them blind. And if they resist, feel free to off them. I take it you punks are responsible? Check it out, thief. Get a load of their stupid outfits. Their clothes look an awful lot like yours, Prince. Oh, a frat with a big mouth! Allow me to teach you some manners! So far, so good! Take that! Don't want to be here anymore! That was not a 
Can you people be? There! Don't let your guard down. Yeah. So good. I must say, you're quite strong for a pipsqueak, but... Just wait, till you see what I'm packing. Nobody's allowed to be more evil than a fiend. Still kicking, old timer? Yeah, thanks to you. Never would have believed just how strong fiends are if I hadn't seen it for myself. Oh, please, those guys, they were nothing. There's an even more pressing matter. The car, can it even run? No, not in this shape. We've no choice but to walk it to Talbo. It's not far. Serious? Oh, for the... I can't believe this. We're not far now. Look, over there. You can see it. He's right. Come on, thief. All right, all right.
Here I go. What's it like in Talbo? It's a former mining town. Not as well off as it once was, but still the biggest town around these parts. Take that! the Aquanium Mine, isn't it? Or what's left of it. By now, the Aquanium Vein's tapped out, and the mine's been shuttered. Of course you used it all out. You humans never know when to stop, do you? Yes, that's Talbo. Now, you two should wait here. It'll cause havoc if people see demons wandering around town. I'll go on my own. Wait, we need water and food, right? Thief can just steal them for free. Huh? N no, that's all right. As a sheriff, I can't condone... You didn't have any money. Don't be ridiculous. Thieves are pro at stealing. You have the costume, right? Yeah. Oh, this is murder on my hairstyle. What's that supposed to be? Even if I get caught, I can just talk my way out as long as I'm wearing this. See ya! Huh? Is that a... It is. Looks like it's in good condition. All right, then. Ah, just what I would... It looks like there's still plenty... Okay, I'll... by the royal army. <laughs> oh, -ho, sounds like these supplies. Stealing from the royal army doesn't trouble me one bit. Take everything you can get, I say. Well, I'll be. Bo 
looks like good eating. Uh, too... All right, you're off the meat hook. Comfort. Ah, oh, that coat softer than a lullaby. Ah, uh -huh. uh, Spino, you have to go south. It's hard to spot, surrounded by mountains. But uh, what? That girl. One looks all you need to know. She's not from around here. Whoops, <laughs> never mind that. Tank parts. Tank parts? Hold up! You mean there's tanks at Naps Bay? I mean, they're getting parts for them, aren't they? Man, a tank! Just once I'd like the chance to modify one of those babies! <laughs> Quit dreaming. Oh, treat me like. Oh, -ho! a tank, you say? <laughs> I've got to tell the prince. Get this. Some strange girl just asked me for directions. Spe you know, where the rebel army had its base way back when. I hear it's been deserted ever since the royal stri- Huh, what? Don't know. Strikes me as odd, though. Huh. You think she could be up to no good or something? Hmm. Don't know what harm she could do there if she tried. Nothing of interest to us here. Perfect. Plenty of food and water here. Should be more than enough for us. That news about the tank is the most valuable piece of this hall, though. Better get going. Prince is waiting for me. Hmm? Not our requisitions? Yeah, but they seem kind of light. <sighs> we'll just have him make it up next month. Huh? Hey! Wait, why are you running? She's got something to... Stop! Great. So that was her bike. Prince! I come bearing food and water! Huh. You're back already? You work fast. <laughs> Not just fast, but talented. Apparently, the army's got tanks set naps back. Whoa, tanks? Awesome! That sure beats a car. Let's go steal one. Hold on there. That's a whole lot easier said than done. Hey, we need some car or other. 
I'm not going all the way to the legendary spring on foot. Hmm. Well, we might as well check out this base. Maybe we'll think of something. Sweet! Let's go! So, where is this nap space anyway? It's eastward of here. <laughs> it's not that far. But it's guarded by the army. We'd best scout the area first. Thank you for coming. We've committed a terrible injustice against the people of Talbot. You mean the food and water I pilfered? Yes. They're barely getting by as things are, so this will have been a real blow to them. Everything I stole was already slated to go to the army. What? I should have known. The ruthless brutes. They must be doing the exact same thing to every town. something up there we could reach it if we had a vehicle that could jump hold on there are soldiers around seems there's a checkpoint ahead we can't be spotted hmm. what to do huh hear that wind it's coming from over there Wind? Ah, from that. Maybe we can slip by the checkpoint and do some recon. Sounds like a plan. Pretty sure I could climb up there. Spot us if we get any closer. Let's see if we can approach from the cliffs. so much why not fight them 30 years ago a whole rebel army dared to stand against them but the royal army tore them to shreds and scattered its members to the wind wow they're really that strong huh i can't wait to charge into their base don't even think about it not even a fiend can take them head on Here we go. Whoop. Bingo, a take. <laughs> it went into the warehouse in the back. That's not from the war. It's a new model. Oh, I like it. Steal it for a thief. D do you realize? All right, I'll do something about it. Uh, aren't you a sheriff? If it belongs to that lousy royal army, it's fair game in mind. Hmm, their security doesn't look very tight. We should be able to sneak in through the side entrance. You've got hairspray, don't you? Mind lending it to me? H hairspray? 
I have an idea. Let's get closer. Don't get spotted. Have you guys ever raided a base before? Nope, never needed to. I see. <laughs> Lucky for us. Us? <sighs> never mind. Are you gonna force the door open? I assume you have one. Thief and I will cause a little diversion out front to draw their attention. When that happens, Prince, you sneak in from the side. What? Wh why me? Go be a decoy yourself if that's what you want. I'm game. Let's... <sighs> Prince, you're... F I'll zip it. Unless you got a better idea. Then it's decided. Let's join back up in the warehouse with the tank. Don't let the soldiers spot you in there. <laughs> You're tell- <laughs> I'll certainly try not to. Now, off we go. Poison gas! Say what? Poison gas? <coughs> What's the ruckus? Hey, who are those guys? Get them! Looks like he pulled it off. <laughs> now it's time for me to shine. Others might get caught if I cause a racket, huh? Better keep a low profile till we've joined up again. Be more careful.
gun down. Oops, they saw me. Gotta be more careful. Oh, nice! There's an opening! <laughs> There's soldiers swarming all over the place. Maybe I can use the cargo as cover. Here we go. Hey, did you hear? Yeah. Heard she had tons of maps, tools, water, the works. Doesn't seem to be from around here. I can jump this distance. <laughs> More soldiers, they're everywhere. I think the tank went into the adjacent storehouse. Careful.
found it. Oh, that's smart. What's wrong with her? That little hellcat really laid into me. Guess she's dead set on staying quiet. Come on. But what about the girl? Shouldn't someone, you know, stand guard? It'll be fine. The door... Yeah, you're right. By the way, how's the tank? It looked like it was falling apart. It'll be useless before long. Gonna have to call a mechanic. Probably shouldn't go too crazy inside the base. So this is a tank. How the heck do you drive it? Sorry for the wait, Prince. So this is our new tank. Look at this. Four anti-grav stones. Big ones, too. But it's mid-repair. Won't run like this. So what are we gonna do? A d demon Huh? You really do exist. Hey. Why? What's it? Promise to get me out of here, and I'll fix it for you. We appreciate the offer. Can't these little details wait? Those grunts will be back any second. Hmm. We don't have the luxury of... Prince, let's help her out. At this point, we need that tank just to escape this base. Okay. And it's your lucky day. I happen to be an ace mechanic. Huh? Wait a second. You're that... Ah, <sighs> so those goons were swapping out the transmission, huh? They don't have a new one, though. Gonna have to jury-rig some old ones to get... What do you need? I'll hop out. Thanks, but this is nothing. Won't take long. In the meantime, how about you introduce yourself? I'm Rao. This here's Beelzebub and Thief. This is the first time I've ever seen a demon face to face. Um, is it normal for you guys to run around with humans like... Absolutely not. Normally, I wouldn't be caught dead with the... Sorry, Gramps. Could you scooch for a sec? I have a name, thank you. Okay, old man. Maybe we can fix the tank. They're already on alert for hostiles after that diversion. We'll fake a deployment order. Prince, Thief, you two hide in the tank. There we go. Nice job. So, do I hide in the tank too? Mm -hmm. Ugh, you're not gonna just leave me here, are you? Uh, no. The soldiers are coming. We've got no choice. Uh, hold on. Forget it. No, there's something very important in my things. <laughs> Why, you... me no choice now we'll have to break through let me take the wheel all right good work <laughs> easy peasy stay sharp kid the front gates to our right head for that soldiers closing in focus or we're toast the front gate right got it 
Reinforcements from the checkpoints. Prince, don't bother wasting time fighting them. Make for the bridge to the right. Roger! The bridge it is! Head straight across. Keep going till you lose them. Enemies to the right! Just ignore them. Turn left. Stay on your guard. You can do this, Prince. Just aim true. Surround and attack! Tank damage exceeds 50%! No, no way! God, without me! Taking out our tanks! Run for your lives! Cleaned every last one of them up without a single fatality. That's one hell of a first run. <laughs> I'd be bored without humans to mess with after all. It looks like we've bought ourselves some time. Let's press ahead. Actually, wait. What's that? Prince, you should try heading over there. There might be some loot to be had. Is this a tank park? Looks like a main cannon. If we install it in the tank, it'll make it way stronger. You mean it? What are we waiting for then? If I remember right, the old road ahead leads to a campsite. We can install it there. We managed to make it to the campsite. Well, in that case... Great idea! Huh, there we go. Your new... Wow! You're... Very impressive. Thing is, though, the transmission's at its limit after that battle. Suspension's on the fritz, too. You know a lot about tanks. Been in one before? Yeah. Tried my hand at any number of things during the war. Tanks I liked. Endless fighting I didn't. Well, I'm glad to have another gearhead around. Hold up. You mean our tank's already fallen apart? We just got it! I can patch it up, but that's a temporary fix. Well, can't you do something, Ace Mechanic? If we had the parts, yeah. And the tools. Of course. You know, I've got a little business in Spino. You guys want to come with? There's a garage there where I should be able to get this fixed up. Spino? Where's that? It's in the mountains to the south. At least, I think. But don't quote me on that. You don't know where the town is, but you know it has a garage? 
Well, someone who used to live in Spino told me all about it. The town may be hard to find, but it actually is quite close by. You know the place? Yeah, been there a few times myself. Don't know what's become of it. Only heard rumors. Well, without the tank, we'll never make it to the legendary spring. <sighs> Traveling solo without my bike really didn't sound like a good time. If that's settled, I'll get started on some makeshift repairs. You guys should get some rest. Thanks. We'll take you up on that.